Bifidoseps, more commonly known as the central bearded dragon. They're found throughout the eastern interior of Australia, and they prefer semi-arid to arid woodland habitat with low humidity. The social network of a bearded dragon is mainly solitary from the moment they hatch, though they display particular behaviors like darkening their beard when they detect predators and head bobbing or waving at other bearded dragons during mating season and during territorial disputes. This is an example of arm waving, which is a type of submissive behavior. And this is an example of head bombing, which is a dominant behavior. Dragon's umbel is chemosensation. The chemosensory system helps bearded dragons gather chemical information from their environment. The Jacobson organ, which is located in the roof of the mouth, is what senses chemosensory information. The sensory system can differentiate between and detect many types of organic compounds. Their non-visual photoreception helps them sense light intensity and brightness. Their parietal eye, which is located on the top of their heads, can detect changes in light intensity but doesn't form images. Vision helps bearded dragons interpret color, depth, and motion. They have tetrachromatic vision, which means they have four types of cone cells in their retina and can see a wide range of colors, including UV light. Bearded dragons use hearing to detect predators and prey and sense vibrations. They do not have external ear structures, but rather visible tympanic membranes on the sides of their head, which can detect a limited range of frequencies. A type of taxis that bearded dragons have is thermotaxis. Bearded dragons are ectotherms, which means that they depend on external sources to regulate their body temperature. Thermotaxis is a primary means of temperature regulation, and they move up and down a temperature gradient to maintain optimal body temperature. There isn't much data available regarding the effects of atrazine on bearded dragons. Alternate finding that, quote, in September 2020, the EPA set a less protective regulatory limit for atrazine that was based on a policy decision rather than a scientific one. A sensitive period for the bearded dragon is the temperature sensitive period, which is during incubation in which developing embryos are sexually labile in response to temperature. A scientific question I might ask is the causal question, does temperature affect Pagonaviticeps rate of movement? My null hypothesis would be that there's no correlation between temperature and rate of movement. My alternative hypothesis would be that bearded dragon's rate of movement decreases as temperature decreases. Here are the behaviors and descriptions that I would include in my ethogram. And here is a sample of the focal ethogram that I would use. I'd use focal sampling because I want to conduct the study on individuals to ensure that their behavior isn't being influenced by the presence of others. To enhance the quality of my observational data, I would train observers on using the ethogram I constructed until they reach a 90% accuracy rate. I'd use an opaque background on the perimeter of the enclosure so that shadows do not influence behavior, as well as install cameras to view the test subjects so that the presence of an observer does not influence their behavior. Lastly, I would install digital temperature sensors to measure and ensure that temperature gradient is being maintained. Here's my bibliography, and here are my photo and video credits. Thank you for watching.